Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to cut multiple clips in your uploaded video over at Canva from scratch. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And the first thing that you need to do is you want to make sure that you're logged into your Canva account as an administrator. And when you go, when you guys go to upload a video, um, you first want to head to the dashboard and select the format that you want to upload here or import. So in this case, I want to upload a video, right? So I'm going to create a blank video or you can click on this. And then from here, uh, you guys would want to click on upload. Now I'll be showing you both steps on what to do, but there's actually a preset here. So let's actually try this one. So if I were to upload this one into here, click on add, it's going to be playing, right? The idea is you guys want to uh, right click into, um, or rather at any format or any, uh, point in video and click on uh, show timing. So this will actually help you um, make the cuts. If you go to um, create clips for it, for example, but let's actually, um, let's actually uh, do one from scratch. So let's go back to um, home and we're going to click on upload. And then we're going to choose a file directly from your computer or assets library over at Canva. So because they're running on a cloud service, you guys could actually upload some of your assets here or videos and choose um, any for, or any asset from uh, your personal library to actually upload as a new project to Canva. So I'm going to choose a new file. I'm going to choose a random video. So give me a second. So let's do this one, this video right here and click on add to uploads. Just like that. And basically let um, Canva work their magic. So we're going, we're going to wait for this to load. Close out of this one. So it's actually uploading now. So just wait for it. So once you guys are over at the uploads folder, you'd want to click on videos as like this, and we're going to play this right now. Let's hold on. And the idea is we want to import this into a new template or a project. So we're going to click on this and move it to a different folder under projects like so. Let's try it again. Okay, let's actually just upload it directly to a new project. So let's go to go back to home and create a new one from scratch. So let's do one using a template. Let's do videos, for example. Let's do this one and start with a blank one. So this will redirect us to a new page where we get to actually upload a video. So if I were to um, click on the upload tab right here, Let's do this one, uploads, and go to the videos tab and drag this here. So here's the video. Okay, so here we are. So if I want to make cuts to the video, I would first want to right click on it and click on show timing. So this one right here will actually help you track the uh, durations in video. And now the idea is if we want to make cuts here for clips, you would want to right click on, actually let's do show timing again. You'd want to right click on um, the uh, the duration right here. So this little bar and click on split page and you'll see that you're actually making cuts but they're all kept within a single project. So if I were to do it again, uh, make cuts for example, or you guys could do the shortcut and click on S to actually uh, split the page. So you want to span, uh, you want to use the slider to span along the duration of the video and hit S. And you can see that you're cutting it into multiple parts easily. Now this is still a single project. Well, you can see that if by hitting the S button or the S key, you're making multiple cuts on one video and turning them into clips. And that's honestly how you guys do it. So yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. Uh, hopefully it helped you out. If it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. 
So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.